brought to you by GTA. We start with you. Leslie and Enoch of the Nama Congregational Church said it was on Tuesday evening when they realized the church had been broken into. I guess they broke into it um, early in the morning, around 4 or 5, because we came to have youth night Tuesday night, and we found out that the door was broken. Upon entering the church, which is located behind Smile Market, Enoch said they noticed their keyboard and the offerings from the weekend had been stolen. The safe was really heavy, like it has to be two or three people to carry it. So I guess it's a group of people, they came and carry our safe. And yeah, they store our safe donations, offerings were inside the safe. The keyboard, valued at $2,000, was a recent purchase to replace the one that was stolen when the church was burglarized back in January of this year. Members had held several fundraisers and even used the remaining funds to replace a door that was damaged during the break-in. Help us find whoever did this so they can put a stop to this. It's, it's not good to steal. According to Enoch, the church was broken into again on Friday, but there was nothing for the burglars to take. She adds that although the church congregation is scared and frustrated, they will work to fundraise and purchase a new keyboard, which is the main instrument the church uses. If you have any information, you're urged to call GPD Dispatch at 472-8911 or 475-8615. You can also submit anonymously through the Guam Crime Stoppers website at guam.crimestoppersweb.com. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Jonah Goncharfris. Brought to you by GTA. We start with you.